Yo, what's up? It's Sharif O'Neal. This is My Time, Episode 2. In LA right now, just about to get some work in with my trainer. Working hard all summer, just trying to get ready for my junior year. Try to go as hard as I can, make sure my little brother is following my footsteps. I try to push him harder than I push myself just because I want him to be even better than I am. He always looks up to me, so I just want to show him how hard he has to work to get to the next level. Because he's 13 right now, but I just want to push him to become a better player. So I have to push myself and also, I also have to push him too. I've been working with James since I was 13. Uh, he's actually helped me a lot. He has a great impact on how I play today with most of my shooting and guard moves. He's from New York, so he's, he, doesn't take, he doesn't take anything lightly. He goes hard all the time. The full workout, he's gonna be yelling at us and trying to get us to do better. What motivates me is like my family motivates me. They're like, oh, they're at every single one of my games, just seeing my brother, sister's mom in the crowd. My dad actually came to a lot of my games this summer. Just seeing him in the crowd just kind of kind of brought me up. Everything is angles, everything is angles. As soon as you get past this screen, take a step, face up, double crossover, one dribble, pull up. Keep your head up, Reef. James, that's my trainer. He's more of like a guard workout, so he works with me with my guard moves, and then when I go with my dad, my dad does the post stuff, so he works out with me and my little brother and my little sister, actually, and we just do shooting, we shoot a lot, we get a lot of like in-game moves, and that's what we mainly focus on. Okay, Q. Oh, there you go. Let's go. Same thing. Same thing. Shot, Kia. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Get in that rhythm. Keep your head up off the step back. Head up. There you go. Good. So I'm transferring this year to Crossroads. It's actually the first home team hoops video was on when I was when I had all those dunks. That's the school I'm going to now. Just it was a family decision, so we decided to go there. It's closer to the house. Me and all my siblings are going there, so that's the new move. Okay, you make sure when you get your foot here, create space. Now you're coming right off of it, straight up. Coming right back off. So it's a screen, re-screen. Let's go. Start off. Let's go. Hit him. Come right off. This is the slice. This is what we call slicing. Let's go. Let's go. Get Reef. Go pull up. Shot. Slice. There you go. Let's go. Make that step right here. Cause now you can go bat bat with you. We just went over. Throw out dribble, go into your one, two. Anywhere in here, it's all yours, man. Free throws. Free throws. Yo, now a little something different. Come off the screen, slice, step back. Kyrie Irving does this very well. This way, same thing. Step back. Now we're coming off of it. Slice dribble, power dribble into your shot. Remember, see how I'm square? So slice dribble, now you're attacking. You're slicing here, power dribble into your shot, straight up. All right? Land yep, feet. land on two feet or one, two, either or. Come around, slice, power, there you go. Now run them off, run them off. Beautiful. There you go, there you go. That look real good, Kia. Let's go, that's what I'm talking about, Kia. Let's go, same thing, two more, two more. Come off of it. Oh, there you go. Shot, shot, let's go. There you go, kid. Let's go, let's go, let's go. There you go. Good square. Good shot. Let's go. Same thing. There you go, kid. 
There you go. Excellent. Let's go. Same thing, Kier. Let's go. Let's go. Shakir's a little late on the growth spurt. Uh, Shakir's a shooter. Sh shooter. A lot of shooting I'm doing with him. Working on his footwork, his endurance, his ball handling, his decision making. But he's more of a shooter as a post player now, so that's what I'm focusing more on him as, as opposed to him. I'm doing both. Splitting the mismatches, obviously the level of competition is much different. The more Shakir gets more acclimated to the concepts of basketball, the sky's the limit for him as well. He's going to be the next best thing. If you get here, if you got to here, bro. Jordan Clarkson pulled through and went and hit hit Aaron Gordon right here, the dude, the dude that dunk contest. He pulled through based on one dribble, and he dunked on three dudes backwards. It was, it was. What, what practice was this? Nike. Oh. I was like, Oh, he did on some kids? No, the college players. Oh. <laughs> the college players, but still, no, 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 no. The college players that he dunked on were bigger than him. <laughs> were bigger than him. This week, there's Nike camp. I wish I would have got invited. I saw I saw a lot of it on Instagram. I saw a lot of my friends uh, posting about it that went. And I mean, I wish I would have got invited, but now I just got to show everybody like that I should have been invited. So next year, hopefully, get the invite to train with the NBA players. Just I just want to have that great experience to bring me to the next level. So hopefully, I get the invite next year. Bledsoe was there. Isaiah Thomas, LeBron, Anthony Davis. Oh, Devin Booker. Devin Booker. He could shoot. He's really really gay. He could, yo, man, Devin Booker, that's the guy from uh, Phoenix, right? Yeah. Oh, he was just not missing. No, from deep. I heard he was going at it with some kid. Yeah, the kid was trying to go at him, but like, he was just so like, whoop, wing. I'm like, sheesh, full speed, running full speed. To be able to catch the ball full speed and stop on a dime and hit an NBA three consistently, that's why he's at the next level. He's gonna have a good season this year. Aaron Gordon and LeBron look like they're jumping off trampolines. Like literally trampolines. I really don't even know. I don't even, I really can't even tell you. I like, I don't know. I would say Aaron Gordon, but. LeBron looks LeBron. so much more like. Oh. I think Aaron Gordon has more style in there, but. And the, from the drills I saw, LeBron was just taking off. But, but Aaron Gordon was taking off like two feet. LeBron was taking off one leg. I'm a one legged guy, so I like the one leg. But he's bringing it back. I don't think you still jump like that, so I thought... Never, me neither. Very, very good, fundamentally sound. But LeBron, he just has it. LeBron has everything. He's like a physical specimen. That's why he's, you know, number one player in the world. We went to a Cavs practice mm -hmm. when my dad was playing. Like, LeBron dunks so hard, like... Because usually it takes me two hands to, like, bring the rim down. Mm -hmm. He can do it once. So awesome. Yeah. Easy. And he's, 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 his, like, base, he has a, a wide base. About 6'9", 260, and he runs the floor like a guard. Like, yeah, he was moving. I was very impressed with him. Because when I saw him practice when the, his first couple years, I was like, wow, he's really athletic and stuff like that. But you can just tell he's, throughout the years he's gotten so much better, obviously. Reef, we got to do it faster this time. You got to be efficient, man. Boom, now get square. That's it. Buckets. He's on you like, yeah, you going to do it? What are you going to do? What are you going to do? Workout's going pretty good. We reached a little tired. He had a, he had a long uh, week in Vegas. Played very well. Uh, just getting back into the gym. He just got like three, four days of rest. Looks good. Uh, just get his win back, stuff like that. Uh, just get ready for the season. You know, just working his jump shot a little bit more, post moves, and we're gonna work on his balance and strength. There you go. Two free throws. Next one, pump fake, go one dribble. Put it on his head. Make him pay. You know you can shoot already. I've had Sharif about Three years, eighth grade, huge progression. He was about six five, I believe, when he first when he first got him. You could tell that the potential was there. I didn't know he was gonna grow. I didn't even I didn't even know who, who he was. So um, we was working on a lot of catch and shoot stuff. I thought he was gonna be a guard, and then he just shot up to like you know six nine, six ten, and hopefully he could you know get even taller, keep him guard oriented and you know post oriented, and then you know exploiting the mis mismatches offensively and defensively and then keep having him understand the concepts of basketball, you know, and ball move, you move, and reinforcing fundamentals, and I think he's gonna have a pretty good uh, basketball career. Just focus on your shot, shoot for six inches above the rim, all right? Shot. My dad, his workouts, they're, they're hard, actually way harder than James' workout. He, he just tries to push me to my full amount, and he lets me dunk on him all the time. That, that video that, that kind of like blew up out of the spot, yeah, I, that wasn't the first time I dunked on him. I dunk on him a lot, actually. And not to worry on going through like contact. He doesn't want me to double pump or anything. He wants me to go straight up. But that video, he didn't actually contest that time. Sometimes he'll actually really 
give me a shoulder check in. It's just, that's way harder than it looks. Shaquille threw his shoulder in. He said, my, 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 my chest hurt for three weeks. He didn't even hurt him. Some big dude from uh, Miami. He said, he threw his shoulder in. That's it, didn't try to hurt him, just threw his shoulder. Bing! So, hey man, you gotta take that bump. But if he's strong and you can, and you can give that bump, they're gonna move out the way. Oh, he bumped you? What? He bumped you? No, your father bumped him. Bumped who? This guy in a uh, play for Miami when he was with Orlando. He's like, my, my chest hurt for three weeks. The shoulder, yeah. He said he didn't even try to, he didn't like mean to do it. He just, a simple routine. Bump. He was tired, I agree. Yeah, yeah, yo, get your wind knocked out of you. Yo, next one. He's like, this how you do. First thing he tells me is never have two bad games in a row. He's saying like every time he had two bad games in a row, his dad, I don't know, he gets some kind of punishment. So like I just, I don't really worry about like the bad games. He tells me if I have a bad game, just don't, just move on from it. Because if I keep thinking about it, then it's going to bring myself down. So when I have a bad game, I'll, I'll be hard on myself until that day is over. And then he also tells me not to worry about like pressure. A lot of people know that I'm Jack's son, so they like expect me to do what he does. And he tells me not to worry about that. And when I see a big crowd, don't worry, just eat it all up. Cause that's what his dad told him to do when there's a big crowd. So when there's a big crowd, I just try to show him what I can do and just try to entertain the crowd. Pango, so it was my first time going. I was happy when I got the invite. Way harder than I expected it to be. Top players in the country. Saw a lot of players that I actually look up to there and, got, and getting to play against them was actually one of the best experiences of my life. When I got the ball, I tried to show everybody what I could do. I got a couple nice little highlights. So yeah, it was, it was fun, great experience. I didn't have to cut my hair. It was just a choice. I kind of just wanted to have a more mature look. My hair, it was super long. I've, I was growing out for two years, so I mean, Everyone was surprised when I cut it. They didn't think I would do it. But I, I like this cut better. Just the short hair just makes everything more easier. Try to jump over the screen. Ready, step, boom. Now it's open, straight up. Here, swing the foot. It's not a travel, all right? Here, swing the foot, one dribble. You can go left hand, right hand, you teardrop. You do one dunk, one teardrop, one dunk, one teardrop. There you go. There you go. There you go. Now two hands and then free throws. Swishes. If it hits the rim, it don't count. Swishes. You gotta make five. That's one. If that hit the rim. One. Don't hit the rim. Swish. That hit the rim. Two. No, it's one. You hit the rim. That's two, three more. Don't let it hit the rim. There you go. Two more, two more. Swish, swish. Good, one more. It's hot in here, you know. Never been so hot during a workout. Getting windy real easily. You tired you here? I mean, I've changed. I took off my shirt. This shirt is drenched. My shorts are drenched. My shoes are wet. It's too, too hot in here. Shout out to home team. Shout out to home team hoops. <laughs> I couldn't play in this gym. Oh, they, they would need AC up in here, dogs. You lose weight up in here. <laughs> hey, it wasn't. Let's go, let's go. Middle, middle, middle. Hey. Let's go. Back around, back around, back around. Same thing, left hand now. One free throw, one three. One free throw, one three. Kia, you're shooting right here. Reef, you're shooting right there. You better backpedal, keep the same pace he's doing. I got, I got Reef, you got Kier. 
Go one. Two. Two. Let's go, let's go, let's go. First one to ten. First one to ten. Hold it up there, Reef. Hold it up. Hold it up. Hold it up. My bad. Let's go. There you go, Reef. Free throw. My bad. Game time. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Now you got elbow. Free throw. Make two swish. That don't count. Hit the rim. Don't count. Don't hit the rim. One. Yo, he, yo, is he gonna be a deadly shooter now? I know. I'm, I'm... Boy passed away, 39 years old. Didn't eat right his whole life. Ate garbage, didn't, he passed away. Cancer, didn't eat right. Your diet is very important, dog. Very important, man. Uh, stomach cancer. Very important, man. Grew up with him ever since a little boy. You know, you gotta eat right, man. No snacks, you know, try to eat natural stuff. Farm raised from the ground, vegetables, fruits, sleep. You should be sleeping around the same time, 10 o'clock every night, which I know you don't. Three, four. Pound the ball, let's go. One, three. Louder. One, one. Together. Don't let the ball die. Three, three, Louder. Back pedal, back pedal, back pedal. Nothing changes, kid. Pound it. Good. One, two. Between legs behind. There you go. One, two. Faster, Reef. Faster, faster. There you go, faster, move, 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 move. Get him up off of you. Faster, come on. Let's go, let's go, let's go. You're going down with the right, back with the left. Let's go, nothing changes, let's go. Faster. Let's go. Work on this, let's go. Oh. Good. Let's go. There you go. This muscle memory, getting used to be able to dribble the ball. In and out between legs, crossover. In and out between legs, crossover. In and out between legs, all right. Ball die, pound it. To me, to me, Reef. To me, Reef. Don't let the ball die. Don't let the ball die. Lower, Reef. Just throw it right back. Just throw it right back. There you go. There you go. Keep it high, Reef. Keep it high. Keep it high. Keep it high. Keep it high. There you go. Keep it right there. 18. 17, 16, 15, push, push, 15, 14, 13, 12, 11, 10, 9, 2, we're done. Rest, I ain't gonna kill you. Tomorrow's another day. We're blessed to have another day. Come back even harder. Shout out to Ryan.